Right, good morning. Uh, just a quick video on the new parking at the lodge for when we do get back in. Um, it's uh, it's changed just a little bit, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna swing you around and uh, and show you the, uh, the changes that have been made. Right, there we go. Um, as you can see. We've got some nice yellow posts uh, outside the gates and a crash barrier that's been um, that's been put in. Now this has been put in by Thames Water and uh, we had no say in the matter really um, about it which means we don't have a disabled bay just there anymore. We will have a disabled bay, I'll show you in a minute. But why they've done this is if I swing round you could see that they've actually widen the road just there and they're going to be parking um, vehicles there waiting to go into the pump station just here. They've widened the road all the way around. Why they've done it is to stop the Arctics from parking up the, um, up the road up the corner here, uh, up the side road and have to back all the way down and round into here which was deemed dangerous and was dangerous. Um, so, but they've decided that they would put this crash barrier in just to safeguard any pedestrians that are walking down there, which I can understand. Um, and I, I, I did liaise with them about um, what they were doing. And this, is, this has been uh, implemented, oh, I can't remember how long now, um, I've known about it for quite a, quite a while, uh, maybe a year, maybe a bit longer, I just can't remember. But um, it's finally been done and um, we've lost our uh, parking bays. So yeah, so where will our parking bays be? Well they'll be just over here, um, on this corner of the cricket pitch. Uh, They've been putting a gate in here somewhere, um, or, or an entrance in there. There will be a hard standing in there, and I believe it'd be a hard stand of something like about six vehicles, uh, which should be ample for us. Um, and if where the white posts are, I don't know if you can see them on this camera, but there are some white posts. If I poke through the fence, there we go. Uh, there's some white posts out there. Um, yeah, that, that's where the roughly where that where it will be the say entrance here and where I'm standing just here there will be a they will put in a zebra crossing uh, put some markings on the road so people can get across uh, just um, smooth that bit of grass out over there so wheelchairs can run over it so I'm afraid that's that's what's happened um, it, it's not changed the entrance to the uh, to, to the lodge, but it has stopped, as I say, the disabled parking. And as I say, they've opened that corner right up, which was a bit of a bind. Um, it was a bit tight for Arctics uh, when they were coming in because they had to come and park where I am and then back all the way down and round into the pump uh, area, the input. But now they can just uh, drive straight round, round the back and come out the other side. So yeah, so there you go. That's uh, that's what's happened. As I say, not a lot we can do about it. Um, turn your back round, there we go. Um, not a lot we can do about it, I'm afraid. Um, so uh, we just, uh, just have to put up with that. Uh, um, I don't know, perhaps it's a safer thing to do because then the cars are off the road. Um, I was always concerned where they were before that a uh, lorry would swing round there and catch one of those cars that were parked on there. Um, so, uh, but everybody else can park in their normal um, car parking area in the social club. That's not changed. So yeah. There you go. See you soon, hopefully. Stay safe and uh, 
It's quite cool out here this morning. This wind is very poor. Blimey. <laughs> it's quite strong, this wind. Uh, looks a nice day. It's lovely and sunny, but the wind whew, is another thing. As I say, turn off an hour and uh, uh, see you soon. <laughs>